For those serious about becoming successful, consistently profitable options traders, now is the time to build skills in technical analysis, market analysis, and applied volatility to get those results. We have multiple memberships, starting with our Go membership that teaches rules-based trading and our Pro membership that teaches more subjective trading. For more information, go to LockInYourSuccess.com slash memberships. Hello, everyone. My name is John Locke, and I'd like to welcome you to The Winning Trade, but first, the required disclaimer material. This presentation is given for educational purposes only. We're not broker dealers or financial advisors, and we're not making any specific trade recommendations. Also, please be aware that your risk in trading options is substantial, and please make sure you're aware of all your risks prior to placing any trades. Also note that in this presentation, any trade and a result, please consider them to be hypothetical computer simulated trades and results. They would be believed to be as accurately represented as possible. Keep in mind, live results can vary from simulated results for many different reasons. If this is your first time with us, my name is John Locke. I'm a trading performance, wealth, and success coach with the Locke in Your Success LLC. And myself and my team of mentors are here to help you win in the markets and in life as well. And today I have a very special treat for you. This is once again the end of the year and we are going to be discussing how some of our trading strategies did and we will be talking about voting for the winning trade of the year. This is always an extremely exciting time of the year for me. I really love when we take a look at what's happened through the year and we can kind of analyze how our trading strategies have been doing and discover what you, our audience, believes is the best trade of the year. But before we do that, let me remind you to please like and share our videos and to come over to thewinningtrade.com and check out the past winning trades that we've had. With that said, let me ask you, what characteristics are you looking for in a non-subjective trading strategy? There are a lot of things to consider. There's trading performance. There's the ease at which the trade can be executed and done. There's the amount of attention you have to pay to the trade as it's going on. How often do you need to check it? How often do you need to make adjustments? Are those adjustments and choices simple or are they complex? Overall performance over short periods of time, overall performance over long periods of time, and so forth. So different things are more important to some people than others. And the way you vote on this helps me understand what is most important to you. And it also helps us guide our material and so forth. So I'm looking forward to hearing from you. And again, come on over to thewinningtrade.com. Make sure you subscribe because that's how you're going to be able to vote. So let's take a look at the winning trade of the year contenders for 2023. So out of our 12 non-subjective trading strategies that we cover in the winning trade, these are the six that performed the best for the year. We have the dependable M3.4U. Trade for trade, this strategy won 100% of our planned capital, 100.8%. That's a fantastic return for that strategy. It had a very good year. If we normalize the return, considering that we have overlapping trades. So some of these trading strategies have overlapping trades where we are potentially in two trades at the same time. When we do that, if we do a corrected return on planned capital, we cut that in half and that would give us our 50.4% equalized return on the M3.4U. Then we have the Mighty Rock. The Rock is a fairly complex strategy, but it is also our best performing strategy year after year after year. It isn't the best performing every year, but if you take the last period of time since, say, 2006, which is when we started either trading live or back testing most of these strategies, it has been consistently or most consistently the highest performing strategy. Also, again, the most complex. We do not overlap trades in the Rock, and the return this year was 62%. Less than normal for the rock, but still a fantastic showing for the year. And our next contender is what we call the, the bear trade. This is a very dynamic trade, and it does well in a lot of market conditions as well. This does also does not overlap trades, and what we had for a return was 45.2% for the year. We have the Steady X4 version 14. This is an overlapping trade, returned 66.2% for the year. If we make that correction, it would be a 33.1% return. 
on our planned capital. And we have the reliable X4 version 17, which returned 82% trade for trade on our planned capital. Again, this is an overlapping strategy. If we cut that in half, that's 41%. And then we have a time-tested M3. And this year, trade for trade plan capital, we returned 40.6%. And we had a 20.3% when you consider the overlap. So these trading strategies year after year have performed extremely well. I'm very excited to present them to you for the winning trade of the year. Let's take a look at their win-loss rate for 2023. So the Mighty Rock was our top performing strategy when we consider overlap. That was a 62% of planned capital for the year. It had nine wins and three losses. We have the dependable M3.4U. Again, that came in a little over 100% for the year trade for trade, but with the overlap correction, it was 50.4%. It had 10 wins and two losses for the year. We have the dynamic bear trade, which does not overlap and returned 45.2% for the year, had nine wins and three losses. The Reliable X4 version 17 had 41% uh, return for the year, corrected for the overlap, and 10 wins, two losses. We have the Steady X4 version 14, which had a 33% return when we consider the overlap. And that had 11 wins and one loss for 2023. And then the time-tested M3 was a 20.8% corrected for overlap and nine wins and three losses. Now, you can go to the winningtrade.com and you can see all the examples of these trades that we did on the winning trade for this year and previous years. We have well over 100 episodes of the winning trade at this point. You can see many, many examples of each of these strategies so that you can and get an idea of how they work and how they perform. And best of all, if you subscribe to us, we'll send you an email and you can vote for the winning trade of 2023. So once again, head over to thewinningtrade.com, watch your email, we'll provide you a link, and you can vote for the strategy. When you vote for your favorite trading strategy, whatever the winner is, we will do that for the next episode, whether it wins or loses, for our next trading cycle or our next winning trade episode. But in order to do that, you need to subscribe. So go on over to thewinningtrade.com and, and subscribe. Also, come on over to lockinyoursuccess.com. That's L-O-C-K-E in your success.com. And discover how you can follow along with these trading strategies and many other great trading strategies as they unfold every week during our weekly Options Trading for Income webinars. While you're there, you can learn about our upcoming winning trade presentations. You can explore past winning trades. And you can receive access to our trading success blueprint that you can follow to become a much better trader. Also, make sure to check out our free trading performance podcast where you can learn to skyrocket your trading regardless of the type of trading you do. If you have any questions, comments, or anything you'd like to see on the next winning trade, please post them as comments on this YouTube video. I'll make sure I answer your questions for you personally. Thank you for joining me, and I look forward to receiving your votes. Trade well, everybody. Have a great holiday season, and we look forward to seeing you in 2024 on The Winning Trade.